everyone welcome back to another terraria video today we are trying to figure out which grappling hook goes the furthest the farthest the longest distance we're going to be checking out obviously vanilla hooks and of course some modded hooks from i believe thorium calamity alchemist npcs and the juice mod i think those are the four that really had you know a bunch of hooks that actually did something or just you know had hooks in general actually i don't think calamity even has hooks so never mind take calamity out but yeah let's go ahead let's check out the vanilla ones i'm gonna try my best to put the numbers on the screen for how many blocks they reach so we're gonna be starting with pre-hard mode hooks we got the shortest range to the longest range in pre-hard mode and uh, a couple of them are stacked on top of each other because they go the same exact distance for example the slime hook amethyst hook and grappling hook all go the same distance same thing with the fish hook ivy whip and candy cane hook so just in case you're wondering why a bunch of them are stacked on top of each other and why we're not going to use all of them that's the reason right there so let's go ahead let's take them and it is time we got our little track not a track our little testing area here with a uh, 20 20 blocks being the orange area 40 blocks if they make it over here to the green area 60 if they make it a yellow 80 a red and it just keeps going until the other finish line but i doubt anything's even gonna make it to yellow well we can't even see that far so we wouldn't even know if it made it that far but let me try my best to line up right here line up my my head pixels with the white or the gray line on that white gem spark block okay that looks about right and uh you know let's see let's see these hooks in action starting with the web slinger we're not gonna go too far out like i said i don't expect any of these to go that far web slinger so that makes it like right to that second to last orange stripe we have okay Next up, the slime hook, which is a really great early hook to get your hands on. This one almost making it past the orange. So this goes probably like 18 blocks, I'm assuming. I don't know. Topaz hook. Boom. This one should go past it. No problem. Yeah, I don't have the exact numbers up, but like I said, I'll try my best to put them on the screen when I'm using them. Next up, Skeletron hand. Very cool hook. And it goes past that first green stripe. Sapphire hook after that. Around the same area. A little bit past that. It hits that glass. The first glass stripe in the green one. Next up is the emerald hook. This one goes a little bit further. I always thought sapphire was better than emerald. But in terms of hooks, you know, this one does go a little bit further. Unless I switched them up. No, it does go further. Next up, the fish hook. One of my favorite hooks because you can shoot multiple of them. You do it with a couple other hooks. But this one... Come on, it's fish on a hook. It's a fish hook. You get it? This one almost goes past that second green stripe. Ruby hook, I'm assuming, goes right past the green second green stripe, and it hits the end of the glass stripe. Diamond hook. Okay, this one hits that third green stripe. Almost goes all the way past it. Okay, I see you, diamond. And last but not least, the best hook you can get your hands on in pre-hard mode, the bat hook, unless you have mods, obviously. And this one goes really far. It's hitting that fourth green stripe just stopping right there not not even like barely going into that glass stripe just that green stripe all right so there you go so the bat hook if you somehow get your hands on it playing with like thorium or something i don't actually know which mod adds in the ability to get event stuff all the time i don't know i have a mod in here that does that but if you're able to luckily get your hands on a goodie bag and get a bat hook then you're set for pre-hard mode the traveling merchant is all up in my course right now get the hell out of here all right next up the hard mode hooks as you can see here a bunch of them go the exact same range these four specifically these are the mimic hooks i believe and then these three the christmas hook and the spooky hook honestly expected that they go the same distance but the lunar hook also goes the same distance as them pretty weird so we only got five hooks we're gonna test out here let me line up perfectly with that stripe again there we go all right let's do it dual hook one of the like most common hooks I guess I mean if you can't find a mimic at all then I guess you won't really get your hands on this hook but this one easily already hitting the green the third stripe in green next up is the thorn hook this one should probably I would say like the fifth stripe in green come on fifth stripe not nah, still in the fourth stripe okay next up is the anti-grav hook now this hook has always been a weird one but uh you know it's unique I'll show off its unique properties but first let's, let's see how far it goes it hits that fourth green stripe going a little bit into the glass stripe okay lunar hook now this is just a really cool hook because obviously you shoot out all the lunar stuff and this one hitting the glass stripe what glass stripe is that the fifth one and then going past the fifth green stripe pretty far We're reaching that 40 block area and last but not least the best hook 
range wise in vanilla terraria is the static hook which goes extremely far pretty much hits that 40 block area but now let's go ahead let's show off you know some of the uniqueness of these hooks starting with this one this static hook right here now it's not your regular type of grappling hook as you can see but it is very cool this can be used in you know certain ways and uh, i don't know if it's the best boss fight material unless you're dodging a boss that's like really slow and you can just go up and down and dodge it then there you go you, you got yourself a grappling hook that can do that but you know you can grab on things upside down and you can do this it's, it's very unique and uh there's definitely some purposes for like building and other stuff next up we got this hook right here the lunar hook where you can pretty much you know do do this same thing you do the web slinger and the ivy whip and all that and uh it's pretty cool and then last but not least the anti-grav hook which shoots you away from where you're grappling pretty similar to a static hook you get a little bit more uh, range of motion you can't go up and down though you can't go up and down like you can with a static hook you can go side to side though you know before we get our hands on some of these uh thorium hooks i should address something because i know it's gonna probably happen it happens in pretty much almost every tutorial video i post i want to address the comments where it's like game writers running out of ideas again or the comments that are like when you run out of ideas you guys gotta understand if i used all of my creative tutorial video ideas all at once and posted them all in like one week we would have no creative video ideas for a while so like i could post all my creative video ideas and then we would be done for like a month is that what we want i don't know every video i post it could be the most creative video ever and somebody would be like you're running out of ideas it's like no i'm not i'm trying to slow my roll and spread out all the bangers so calm down with those comments i'm probably gonna see like a lot of them now because i addressed them but let's go ahead let's get to the thorium hooks i'm ready for this i'm ready for this thorium hooks has one of my favorite grappling hooks that being the ghostly grapple and uh you know we got the leviathan onyx hook opal hook jeweler's wall grip neptune's grasp devil's reach fungal hook and goes to grapple honestly i have no idea about half of these the only ones i really use from thorium is the onyx one or the opal one because you know they're pretty easy to get your hands on and the ghostly grapple because it's probably one of the best hooks in modded terraria besides like one or two other ones but yeah let's go ahead let's show these ones off i think i have these arranged by distance yet again so let's start with the leviathan there's some of these are hard most some of these aren't so uh you know you can always just go on the wiki and figure it out but let's start with the leviathan which if it's you know lower than the onyx and opal hook then i don't expect it to go far at all but ooh, this thing has a nice little cool effect on it so it like reaches that first green strike this one you can shoot a lot that's probably why you know it loses distance i don't think i ever understood why you should lose distance just because you can shoot multiple hooks for example the web slinger absolutely useless hook because it goes what like 16 blocks just because you can shoot out like five grapples at once what's the point of shooting out a bunch of grapples if you can't reach anything like i don't think that's a good like compromise for balance but yeah let's move on to the onyx hook this one great hook to have early hard mode gets you to that green slash first glass stripe in the green next up the jeweler's wall grip and neptune grass these both have the same distance and this one it's got some distance on it it's got some distance the third green stripe let me see the neptune's grass just because i want to see it it looks exactly the same we'll, we'll do the same with the opal since you know i already did it all right devil's reach this one i think you get from a mimic from thorium the Thor thorium mimics this one reaches that fifth green stripe and that second to last glass stripe okay fungal hook of course i love me some mushroom stuff i believe you get this from the mushroom mimic this is going way 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 like this is not going as far as the wiki stated let me look at the wiki real quick and make sure my information is right because this is supposed to go as far as the devil's reach and as you can see it's hitting that third green stripe barely all right so i went on the wiki to confirm and they both say 32 blocks I, I don't know why because this definitely does not reach as far as the devil's grasp uh the Grevel's, devil's grass says 32 blocks also which seems about right and the fungal hook seems about like 20 some 20 22 24 blocks so hopefully they fix that last but not least the ghostly grapple my favorite grappling hook because of how far this baby reaches let me zoom out okay i can't zoom out any further but this thing should easily pass 40 or hit 40 something like that all right this is not going as far as i thought it would i swear that this is 40 blocks I, I counted them i swear this thing was supposed to go way past this it's all good it's still my favorite hook extremely fast hook extremely long range hook 
it reaches that like barely touches that second to last green stripe but there you go there's all the thorium grappling hooks and like i said calamity doesn't have grappling hooks which is a very interesting thing i found out recently because i swore it had something but i guess not all right we're coming down to our last set of hooks we got a bunch from the juice mod four of them and then we got two from alchemist npcs if i miss any hooks my bad they're probably not called hooks uh but i think this is pretty much a majority of hooks most mods have hooks that just you know they do the same old same old they just go in a straight line and there's nothing crazy about them but no we got a we got a couple of unique ones here especially from the juice mod i believe all the ones from the juice mod are very unique all right so let's go ahead let's test these babies out starting with the swingy hook which is a very unique hook i'll show them off at the end but first let's just see how far they reach this one reaching that that orange area nice next up the enchanted swingy hook which oh it's got some distance this has some distance reaching that fourth green stripe next up grabby swingy hook boom okay this one did not go as far as i thought it was gonna go this one reaching that orange stripe much like the original swingy hook and last but not least from the juice mod cactus worm hook which is a very very unique hook but for it being unique it doesn't it doesn't go the furthest which is that like second glass stripe not too bad though and let's go ahead let's go over the celestial hook and the grappling hook gun from alchemist npcs this one i didn't even know they had this the celestial hook this one reaches that 40 like 42 block range it seems like touching that first yellow stripe and the grappling hook gun which i used to honestly use on this creative character until i started using the uh, light version of alchemist npcs but this one i think might go off screen it might possibly go off screen yeah it looks like it just barely goes off screen it looks like it ends right there at that 60 sign which is pretty insane and it's really fast too really really fast and you know if a grappling hook goes off screen it's a pretty damn good grappling hook but yeah there we go there's all the grappling hooks now let me go ahead show off a couple of the special things these hooks do the celestial hook it does, it does a little cool sum sum it shoots all over the place a bunch of times and now all these juice mod hooks they're all very unique like i said let's start with the cactus worm hook this one extremely unique extremely useful in certain situations check this out and look at that we are snaking through the wall i don't know if you can see me here let me turn on the light here but we are snaking through the wall very very cool and unique hook like i said very useful in certain situations uh the hook itself since it doesn't go that far maybe not the most useful in terms of just you know using a hook regularly but if you ever need to you know get through some walls well then you're set all right let's show off these two swingy hooks which if you can tell by their name are swingy move left or right to swing move up or down to retract and extend boom let's go ahead let's let's uh, retract attract i don't know but look at this this is really cool uh it's like a tire swing i don't know it's a swingy hook that's really all there is to explain it but this thing's awesome we can can we go underneath the platform oh, slowly but surely slowly but surely we can get underneath oh shoot same thing with the enchanted swingy hook does the same thing it's just enchanted and better and last but not least is the grabby swingy hook i don't know if this does the same thing because it does say it's a swingy hook okay yeah you could do the same thing but it says you can grab onto enemies which is very interesting i don't think i remember ever testing this hook out but let's do it it's like i have a a pet a pet on a leash take me places he's not the fastest pet you think i can grab onto a bird and then scare the bird off while he drag me around oh shoot i don't know if he can hold up all the weight oh he, he's holding the weight he's holding the weight it's just gonna take a while maybe man, maybe we could do a whole video you know testing this out on some stuff let me test it out on one more thing though before we end off this video you know i want to test it out on a boss to make sure that we can grab onto bosses might be kind of hard to grab a boss there we go and it kind of just let go oh there we go okay as long as the boss doesn't do any uh you know very r r rapid and rash movements we should be able to hold on i don't know i guess we'll see when she dashes oh it lets go when she dashes because she's going way too far all right well good to know that's how it works kind of upsetting though i kind of you know hope it just held on no matter what but there you go there's a bunch of grappling hooks we just showcased it seems like the best one obviously is from the alchemist npc mod and then if you don't have alchemist npcs which you probably usually should it's a pretty decent mod at least the light version the ghostly grapple probably your next best guess and then the static hook which i did use in a couple playthroughs but since it's a little weird probably the lunar hook spooky hook christmas hook one of those i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and sub to this channel if you enjoyed the content make sure to follow my twitch 
Twitter, join my Discord, and subscribe to my second YouTube channel where I post my full live streams. I will see y'all in the next video. I love you guys. You know what? Before I end, let me just show off these hooks that I didn't show off because I feel like someone's going to get mad that I didn't show them off. All right, ready? Boom. There's the worm hook. Boom. Tendon hook. Amethyst hook. That hook. Ivy whip. Candy cane hook. Spooky hook. Christmas hook. And a luminant hook. Thank you for watching the video. Bye-bye.